Good morning and welcome to a beautiful Montana day. It's snowing outside. It's September and about 35 degrees. But I got an exciting video to do today. It'd be a little interesting um, and challenging. I got some super fine stuff to run today. I want to tell you how I got this and where it came from. A buddy of mine stopped the other day when I was running my sluice box and he stopped by just to look at some sapphires that we had found and he's really into sapphires he buys and sells and cuts sapphires and he goes hey you got a sluice box he says I don't have one of them he says I got some concentrates at the house and if you want them you're more than welcome to them you can run them through your your sluice and you can keep all the gold that you find just let me know how much you find in there I said fantastic so the next day stops by and drops off these two buckets of dirt and I'll show you this in a second but what this is on things just like concrete but it's really fine material it's almost sand and small rocks and it's just got tons of little tiny specks of gold in it. I mean fly poop, half the size of fly poop. I panned some out. Super fine gold but there's tons in there. Um, I don't know there's got to be thousands of little pieces of gold in here. We'll see what we get. Um, what this is, is it came out of a sapphire jig. So when they put the material and run the material across the sapphire jig, there's a rubber tire at the bottom and then there's a screen where the sapphires sit. It goes like this and sucks all the heavies down to the bottom. Sapphires stay on the screen and everything else runs down into that tire down below and it just sucks it all down. So when they're done running, they open a valve, drain out the, the uh, muck that's in the bottom and all the heavies that fell down and that's what this is. So this is, I don't know how many yards it would take to actually produce this, but a lot. <laughs> so I've got these two buckets here, and I'll give you a shot. Um, this will be a little challenging. Um, the sluice box is probably not the best setup for this. Um, maybe a gold cube or a miller's table. Um, something like that might work a lot better. But... This is what I've got, so we're going to give it a shot. I've just been running it a little bit. I've got a little bit of gold up in here. I'm just trying to get it set up. I tried it with just the black mat because I've got my sluice box all ribbed there all the way down. But I was having a problem trying to get all the fine to go out. I'm afraid I'm going to blow it all out. So I added... You know, if these just get stuffed with material, all the fine golds are going to slide right on out. So I went ahead and put some carpet in and expanded metal. And I'll get the camera here and I'll show you kind of what I got going here. Since this is super, super fine, there is some a few bigger rocks in it and stuff. But this is the material I've got here. It's just uh, sandy, lots of black sand in it. Um, so what I'm doing is I'm taking this, see if I can do this one-handed here, and I'm putting the material, just scooping some in here. Then I'm sifting it down. This is a... Uh, 20 mesh stream, so everything going in the bucket is going to be minus 20, and everything going in here is going to be plus 20. And I'm going to have plenty of time to sit here and do this while I'm sluicing it out because it's going to take a lot of time to work this black sand and stuff down. get a little more I 
Okay. So we got a little bit of material in there. And I figure I'm just going to do this as I'm as I'm sluicing here. Pour that out. So that's what we've got. Just super fine sand. And we'll go ahead and fire up the sluice box. And we'll get her going here. I think I got it about where I want it. It's taken me, I don't know, half an hour to try and get this set up. So just super fine. And I'm just going to dribble this in and let it work its way down. It's probably going to take me at least all day to get through these two buckets. But if I can catch it, we'll see. But the beauty of this is, even if I don't catch it all, I'm not losing it because it's going right into my tub. And of course I'll have to check it and see and make sure I'm getting all my all the gold out of there. I can see the black sand just starting over the hump there, so that's good. Hopefully I don't have to adjust this anymore, but it's going to take some time. And there should be quite a bit of gold in there. So I'll get working on it and get classifying this down. And I'll check back with you in a bit here. Well, I've been at it for about five hours now. It's uh, snowing out. I got my umbrella up. But I think I've had it five hours and I've got over a half a bucket left finished one so we'll shut this off and take a look in the map I think I see some gold in there so we'll get a peek at it and I'll have to finish this probably tomorrow in between the football game I guess Oh wow, there's some fine, fine gold in there. Let's see if we can even see it. Fine, fine gold. Oh, there's a decent piece right there. Decent piece there. I see gold, quite a bit of gold in there. Anyway. I will turn this off and I'll be back tomorrow. Now I'm back for day two of finishing out my concentrates here. Um, at least it's not raining, sun shining, um, it's cold. It's got down to 23 degrees this morning. I think it's up to my, maybe 32 now. But we're going to get this finished up. Um, I'm pretty dang happy with uh, the way this is running. Um, I can just see the black sand lining up here before it goes down the sluice. I cleaned out a bunch of the tailings that I sluiced the other day. And I did not, I panned out probably six pans of dirt out of the tailings. And I didn't find one speck of gold. So we are catching all the gold. That I can find. Um, it is super, super fine. But I did clean this out, and I've got that sitting in the bucket over here. Uh, you can just see it working in here. There was just so much black sand in here. Anyway, we're going to get this sluiced out and cleaned up. Well, there we have it. That's all the gold we got from the concentrates we had. Um, there is some really, really fine stuff in there. Anyway, that's what we ended up with. And I'll take it. Pretty happy the way the sluice box ran. Um, here's all the magnetite I took. Oh, that's not the magnetite. There's all the magnetite I took out. I suppose we'll have to go through that one day. Anyway, that's our gold we got. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye now.